Being a pilot is obviously a very exhilarating job. You're flying faster than the speed of sound, so nothing can get more exciting than that. The Auto GCAT system is an extremely credible system amongst the pilot community. We've already seen it save eight lives in seven jets. I particularly like the system because it gives me that blanket of security, knowing that there is a system there in case I have a controlled flight into train or a G-lock situation, I know that will save me. Coming home becomes even more important when you know you have somebody there waiting for you. I have a little girl who's now depending on me and my husband. We both fly. She thinks she's a pilot and she likes to wear her little flight suit. The F-16 is an extremely powerful jet. The version that my husband flies um, currently does not have AG casts. Honestly, that would give me a lot more comfort knowing that my husband would be flying with the auto G cast system. Some of the biggest things that you will see is just stepping into the cockpit, you will notice between a Block 52 and a Block 7072 is our large 6x8 uh, center pedestal display, which provides capability of moving many of your sensors into a much larger capable um, display where you can see uh, a lot more things easier, as well as moving your radar and your uh, air to air, both air to air and air to ground, as well as your timing pod. Uh, there. You will also get with our Block 70 and 72, you'll get a um, automated ground collision avoidance system or our AG CAST system. This is already proven to have saved eight U.S. Air Force pilots. Um, so this system will uh, use calculations based off airspeed and altitude to recover the jet in case the pilot becomes uh, incapacitated or uh, spatial disorientation. Um, other things you'll see is an upgraded helmet. So our new Jehemix 2 helmet that comes with the uh, package as well provides a capability of targeting high off bore sight, uh, as well as being able to slew some of your sensors to be able to see that. Um, and minor upgrades to the avionics computer systems, uh, and I've already mentioned about the AEC radar. Uh, the Block 7072, the engine uh, is either uh, GE or Pratt & Whitney, so depending on which, it, it, it's not a, an upgrade. So I, I'd like to say that um, the U.S. and its allies are always looking for a combat capable aircraft, one that will always enhance our capabilities against uh, emerging threats that are out there. So this Block 7072 will do that for you. Uh, and it will also be able to provide a cost-effective uh, bridge towards the F-35. Hi, Ad America. My name is Manessa Balsizer, and I'm here with Lockheed Martin. And we would love to wish you guys a happy 8th anniversary as you guys continue the Ad America message of explore, experience, and express. Thank you, guys. America. My name is Vanessa Balsizer. I'm an F-16 pilot vehicle interface systems engineer for Lockheed Martin Aeronautics and a former F-16 uh, fighter pilot with the United States Air Force. Myself and my colleague, Rich Johnson, who is a director of business development and former C-130 pilot, would love if you guys could join us for an Ad America event on November 3rd and November 4th at the Pacific Place Mall. We are going to share our stories from young pilots to now members of one of the largest defense contractors in the United States. So if you want to hear about some of our experiences and how we overcame challenges both in the military and corporate world, please come join us on Saturday, November 3rd or Sunday, November 4th. We hope to see you there.